at five, an Austin police officer linked to a murder case loses his job today. And now investigators say he has fled the country. The Austin police officer connected to a murder victim, Samantha Dean, has been fired. And APD believes Von Trey Clark fled the country to Indonesia, a country that doesn't have an extradition treaty with the United States. KXAN investigator Robert Maxwell is here now with the latest on this murder story that's been drawn out for six months. Rob? It's taken a long time. Police say they're being careful with the investigation. Just this afternoon, Austin police officer Von Trey Clark was indefinitely suspended after a disciplinary review hearing, one that he wasn't at. A memo shows he was fired for insubordination after refusing to come in and talk with internal affairs investigators about the Dean murder. That was last Saturday. Factor in alleged associations with known felons and going absent without leave. Police brass say they have no choice. Now, APD learned about the AWOL this past Friday when Clark boarded a flight from Dallas, Fort Worth to Japan and route to Jakarta, Indonesia. After issuing a seven-page disciplinary memo today, a very terse Chief Aceveda refused to even call Clark a former officer, instead using the word Mr. Paints a picture that makes me very angry, paints a picture that makes me sad, and it paints a picture of betrayal. Betrayal to a profession, betrayal to an oath, betrayal to the law, and betrayal, I think, ultimately to the sanctity of life. And I think at some point we will see Mr. Clark back. Now, Chief Acevedo did not elaborate on why he thinks Clark will be back in Austin at some point. The chief also appealed for Clark to simply turn himself in and come home. At 6, we'll give you a listen to that, a direct appeal to Clark from the chief, a chief known for his colorful comments. And remember, what Austin police did today was administrative, had to happen under the city's civil service code. The criminal case is in the hands of the Texas Rangers and Bastrop's sheriff's office. At last check, no charges have been filed against anybody in Samantha Dean's murder. Shannon. All right, Robert, thank you. Clark's attorney called the chief's remarks about his client slanderous. In a statement, he says these latest allegations are a stretch of both the facts and policy and should be easy to overturn at arbitration if we choose to proceed with it. The attorney also says Clark traveled to Indonesia for medical reasons. This is a case we have been following for months. To give you some perspective this evening, Samantha Dean's body was discovered back on February 4th in Bastrop County. We learned the next week that Officer Clark had been placed on leave. In May, we learned about a search warrant where officials took things like Clark's shoes and electronics as well as a DNA sample. Last week, unsealed court documents show authorities believe he was in contact with career criminals who may have killed Dean.